Hi everyone and welcome to Titan Academy. Um, me and Zoe are going to do a video today on combining the two types of chop kick that we went through in a previous video. Um, I'll briefly describe them. The first one is a front leg chop kick where you raise your knee and you flick your foot towards your opponent like that. It's really good for leading with the front leg because if you swing your leg it's blocked, if you bend it you can get round the guard. The second one is a more straight leg swinging chop kick from the back leg like this. Um, if you were to lead with a bent back leg, it might be quite easy to block. Or see coming. If you swing it, you can get round the guard. So if that guard's up, and that's covered. All of that's covered in the last video, so you can check that out. And we're just going to put them together, and this is a really good way to drill it, just so you get used to how these tips work. These work. So front leg, knee up, and you flip like this. As that lands, the back leg comes up, swing and down straight. As the back one comes down, reach it forward um, because it's likely your opponent will lean their head back. So you bring it up, they lean back, and you push it towards their head. Okay, so the combination is this. Let's say two of us are sparring. The idea is if both were to hit, this one is this, and then the back one, as I get closer, I'm sort of close enough because the last move is up and down. Okay? It works also if they see the first one coming. So they get out of the way and try and retaliate, like the back leg peach egg or something. Here, one, and you can get right on their head. Okay? And it should be three points, but it really should be a knockout. Okay? If you use a heel like that, bang, do a great shot. So that's what it is. Okay? So it's front leg from your ready position, front leg flicking chop, back leg as you've gained that uh, distance, big swinging chop. And the power's on the down on both of them, okay? So we're going to do it three times each side. Do it along with us, please. Feel free. But do it many times. I think the more you drill something, the more it gets really ingrained in your head, okay? So bouncing, front leg really flicky and quick and snappy. So one, flick and swing. Back leg's a big motion and down hard. Okay, again. So, two, flick and down. Think about where your hands are in between. How would you like to guard? Three. Flick. Down. Good. Down the leg. Bouncing to the front leg. You can even, if you've got space, pop in for the first one. So you're chasing someone down. Get them on their back foot. One. In. Down. And back. Two. Flick. Back. And think about where your hands are during the kick. Three, and down. Have fun with that, play around with it. Let me know what you think about it. Um, and you'll probably see more of that this Saturday at 9.30 in the morning when we do our Taekwondo workout. So if you practice that, you've got a head start on the competition. See you later.